it's my pleasure to affirm uh, that pursuant to a vote by the Mets Hall of Fame committee, uh, Keith, Keith Hernandez, number 17, will be retired this year in a ceremony on July 9th. This is uh, one more step in celebrating Mets history and its great players. Keith is only the fourth Mets player to have his number retired and is the fifth overall, including Jackie Robinson. Keith came to the Mets in 1983 in a lopsided trade with St. Louis, played a memorable part of the 1986 championship team, hit 310 during that season with a 446 on base percentage. Music to my ears. He was a first team captain elected in 1987 and was elected to the Mets Hall of Fame in 1997. A great career, named to five all-star teams, 11 gold gloves, six with the Mets, batted 297 through his Mets career, which is second in Mets history. It caught me completely by surprise. I had no idea and um, it's uh, just kind of soaking in and sinking in now today. Um, uh, the import of this, uh, it is really, if you think of it, and I'm so honored, is that this is the highest uh, honor that an organization can give to a player. And, uh, you know, I grew up as a kid, like everybody else, going to baseball games and going to those some of those parks with the names up on the wall. And I'm um, at the names, the, uh, the numbers that are retired. And for me, just a little old blue collar kid growing up in Northern California on a beach town called uh, Pacifica, 17 miles south of Candlestick Park. A dream to be a ball player and then to have uh, attained that and all the success, fortunately, that I had through, through in Major League Baseball. I had a lot to do with my former teammates uh, as well. Uh, but this is uh, uh, unbelievable. Uh, I am just ecstatic and so proud and so thankful.